All right, so let's see how we did. We got good production from Robertson. I'm curious. So Blake Robinson had a touchdown, but then he must have gotten hurt, right? Because he didn't touch the ball at all after. I don't know. That was a weird ordeal. Um, Adam Carter got a touchdown. I feel like I'm the bane of every team that I leave because here he is playing for me just a season later and playing well. And I, I believe I traded a decent amount for him. It'd be really cool if they added in whatever pick this became. Um, let's see. Yeah, so I in a year, they lost from a first round pick down to a third. And they only got two seasons with him for less than 2,000 yards. And the second season was just not good. Probably was a wide receiver three. That was with... Actually, no, I think he was the wide receiver one under Tandy, right? No, two. I don't remember. One or two. All right. Week two. There we go. This is a hot start. I'm enjoying this a lot. So, Blake Robinson's struggling with the yards per carry. Let's see how the rest of our team's doing. Receiving-wise, we're doing phenomenal. Tight end is, like, all over the place. I like it, though. It's good production. Um, looking at our corners, I think we're doing well. I don't really get defensive stats as much. Um, if somebody wants to, like, let me know how to see if my cornerbacks are playing well, that'd be great. All right. So we're now 3-0. and uh, Good start. That was a good game by um, Blake Robinson. Um, and Penny Robertson is looking really good. How did you do last season for them? So he, he's like one of those rare holdovers. He's actually from St. Louis. That's pretty funny. Um, definitely not back when I was there, uh, but he's a great receiving back. Honestly, he's kind of a perfect fit for this current team. Um, turns out he's a first round pick. Definitely a disappointing first round pick to get a receiving running back. Nico Carlson. Defensive lineman? Yeah. Our line must be scary. Like, I only have two sacks, but two interceptions and three forced fumbles among them. That's, we have a beefy O-line. So, he's on pace for a thousand yards rushing. Um, definitely outproducing my expectations here. Clear cut number one back for me. And boy, does... <laughs> having a great year. A little disappointing, to be honest. But I think that's more a product of the fact that we're just getting good play in general from our entire team, not just him. So now we're 5-0. and oh. This is a phenomenal start here. Um, I wonder if we're making money. I guess we'll figure out at the end of the season here. But we're definitely cooking on offense. I feel like Robertson's that guy that like people totally were sleeping on, and now he's putting up these massive stats. Um... Even receiving-wise, he's doing pretty well. And it's not like Robinson's a complete bust for us. He's playing okay. Looking at wide receiver here, we're getting really good production from Trey Kelly. He might be able to hit 1,000 yards this season. McGriff is getting the touchdowns, which is funny because he moved over to tight end, so I guess that makes sense. Boyd continuing to play well. All right, first loss. We'll see who's at fault for this one. Um... Blake Robinson got a sa got tackled for a save. Grant Nash, the bane of my existence. Didn't realize he was still in the league. How old is this man? He's only 28. This dude has like ruined a couple of my teams now. Um, just great playoff performance. Two championships. Um, 22 and 23. Or 2012 and 2013. Two finals MVPs. This dude's one of the best running backs, if not the best of all time. That's pretty impressive. But he's, I would say he's declining, but he's still playing good. He's definitely that guy, though, that if he hits free agency, I'm totally going to scoop him. Um, because I feel like he could put up big stats in the right offense. Which, I guess he's still putting up good stats, so. And we'll keep going. But it looks like Robertson is starting to slow down a little bit. Um... Which might be good for Blake Robinson to take some of the weight off of him. Uh, Darryl, uh, Daniel Powers playing fine, but not great. 
And with that, we're getting close to the trade deadline here. I don't know if I want to make a move for a running back because he was playing really well, but he's definitely taken a step back after a hot start. Wide receiver, uh, quarterback wise, we're doing great. Wide receiver wise, could be doing a little bit better, but we're not doing poorly. Um, I, got, I really do want to see what if I move my first round pick. What could it get me? Could it get us a guy that's going to put us over the top? We're just seeing depth players so far. Nothing super exciting. See, if I move it, I want a true star who's going to be like a difference maker day one. I just don't see that right there at all. You know, maybe I'll see what my third round pick could get, because these guys are more third round pick options than I'm seeing here. And if I could get like one of the, wow, nothing for third rounds. What if I traded a second round pick? An O-line guy, that's not a ton of value. Overpaid defensive back, not a ton of value. Overpaid backup quarterback, not a ton of value. Prospect defensive end, still nothing worth investing in. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything particularly great. My second rounder. All right. I tried. What if I. This might seem stupid, but what if I'm willing to, like, take on a contract? Could I get. No, I can't. Okay. So, with that, um, we'll go to the next week. Alright. Performance-wise, I think we're doing okay. As um, Boyd is playing great, as expected. We have just one loss. We're definitely got to be one of the favorites in the league here. Let me actually go check league power rankings. Honestly, I'm kind of surprised that we have the 10th rated. Wow, we have the 5th rated due to injuries. That's silly. Quarterback, we're good. Running back, not so much. Wide receiver, also not so much. Really? Damn. Tight end. Eh, not too bad. O-line, not great. Defensive line, not great. Linebacker, great. Cornerback, great. That's weird. We're not even great at corner. We have one punter and... Wow, that's pretty funny. Um, how good is our kicker doing? Yeah, he, he's kicking a pretty good clip, but he only has 13 field goals on the season. Which I feel like is super low, considering we're... putting up decent amount of points, right? Yeah. Like, we only have a few games under 20 points. But, I don't know, I suppose we're just a methodical offense. Like, we do have a lot of rushes... For a team that's mostly a passing team. Um, like we're probably going to finish with almost 300 carries. Wow. Two straight losses. That's kind of surprising. Let me take a look at Boyd's rushing stats. He's only run 31 times this season. He ran a lot more last season. Which I guess is a product of how deep our team is now. And how well it's playing overall. Let's see, can Robertson do something good? Nope. We just got killed with injuries that week. But ultimately, it matters if we're healthy, which we will be, hopefully, for the playoffs. Um, We are getting closer and closer. Here, let's see um, what our team is. We're 9-5. Um, 